Hello guys, it's Moritz Maiski here. Finally, after a long time we are back. There is a website called greengamedevelopment.com. Please go to the website and please fill in the subscribe form by just giving your email address and press on join because uh, that way we know there is support for our game and we can continue working on it and in the end also talk about crowdfunding. So, the whole idea um, that this started was actually the remake of Little Big Adventure. Some of you guys uh, saw my video and were very enthusiastic about it, so we decided to continue the work. Unfortunately, it was not possible uh, to uh, work together with TJ Chanfoy because we didn't have a game company. We are now uh, making a game company. Uh, so the only thing is that we need to know for sure that there is support. And then we can also continue our work uh, on the game called Walkie. Well, of course we will continue the work anyway, but it will be so much more easy with your support. So please go to our website and fill in that subscribe form on the top on the right by giving your email address and press on join. I cannot say this enough because it is so important that we have your support. Okay. That being said, uh, the other subject is uh, or are the two demos that we shared. Uh, you can find them under the video in the link. There are two links actually from Google Drive, one with the Little Big Adventure Remake demo and one with the Kowalki demo. But the Kowalki demo is from 2016, so it's very old. It's in a point and click style. It will not be like that at all in the end version, but it gives you already an idea about the story and about the atmosphere of the game. So that's why we thought it is a good idea to share this with you. So please go on, uh, download the Big Adventure Remake demo and the Kowalki demo, play them. Of course, uh, if we talk about the Little Big Adventure Remake demo, it's totally not finished at all, but again, it also gives you an idea about the play style and you know, just how it feels and how it looks. You know. Uh, okay, so that's it, and now I will show you some footage of our new game, Kowalki, or at least the new version. Enjoy! So, here you can see uh, what we made so far. So, as you can see, the game is now in complete 3D, and the camera is from the side. You can walk, well, a lot of directions. So, the, big I the game, I mean, is, a big, uh, is way bigger than it was before. Uh, so this gives also much more uh, options, I think, for the game. I would say myself that the game uh, has now, instead of a point-and-click style, a sort of alone-in-the-dark one style, if you uh, remember that game. That was, I think, the first really big game from Frederic Reynal. And uh, I also played it. I think I even played it before A Little Big Adventure. Uh, so I was very young uh, then at those days, but I still remember it pretty good. Of course, the controls were not great and, you know, a lot of things were not uh, super convenient. Uh, but uh, the game had a very dark atmosphere and it uh, certainly made an impression on me. So I think you have to see the game as how we now made it. It's a bit more uh, towards that direction, so the direction of the Alone in the Dark game. Uh, in terms of gameplay, but it will also be very uh, heavily focused on storytelling and finding objects, you know, uh, just like in a point and click game where you have to find objects, talk with people. This will be actually the main goal of the game. And of course, there, also be, there will, al will be also uh, fights, uh, a bit of fighting in the game, uh, just like in Little Big Adventure. But it will not be, of course, like Mortal Kombat game, you know, with a lot of advanced controls and uh, not at all like that. Uh, but it, you could say it will be a sort of accompaniment of the game. So, uh, well, we hope uh, that you like it. And, uh, well, I am very much looking forward myself to make this game. Uh, the first idea was actually to, uh, to make a whole game in one time. We, we are now thinking about making a game that is uh, certainly a big game, but we will maybe split it up in episodes. So uh, then it's also way more doable. And uh, I think we can also make this way a very long game. Uh, and 
I think uh, this would be very a very interesting idea to uh, to explore. I think actually that it will also give us the most uh, well the best way of making it because you know if you make a big game you will always work on it like three years and if you just put it in smaller episodes you know and we have a good team put together then well it would take us maybe only three months or four months to uh, make such episodes and you will still need to play you know like one and a half hour uh, and that is only if you know uh, what the clues are you know uh, because what I say uh, what I al what I already said is that the game is uh, putting really uh, very big emphasis on storytelling. So you really have to use your head also a bit and to think about uh, what you have to do next. So it will not only be like uh, a walkthrough, like you just fight with people and then the you have the next room or the next island and etc. etc. No, you will really have to for example talk with someone and understand what he or she says or uh, what kind of clue he or she gives and uh, then you have to find an object for example or you have to put some objects together you know this kind of gameplay uh, is the most important to me and uh, next to that gameplay yes you have some fighting mechanics as well um, so yeah and the reason that it took us uh, so long now to come back to you and make a new youtube video was just because unreal engine was very new to me i had to really discover it myself how it worked because i worked like uh, for eight years in unity so i mean of course there are also a lot of similarities between the engines which is really nice but yeah in general things just work a bit differently and um, that just takes time so um but to say some uh, different things uh, about this game is that, uh, well, I hired uh, someone two months ago and uh, he made uh, some gameplay of this uh, scene that you see here, uh, but it's not fully integrated. Uh, so that's the reason why I cannot show you that, but I can show you a video of how um, it will be looking a bit because this guy that was working for me made a video of what uh, his work was and I also received the scene but I just didn't integrate it yet on my computer or on my project um, so you can see here for example that uh, well uh, you see the same camera view and you see uh, how the game mechanics are working the AI is not doing anything at the moment but of course uh, that will be a different story very soon and uh, well, we have to work still on the inventory, you know, so that is not yet integrated. Uh, but so bit by bit, I try to uh, find people that do work for us and uh, to make a team. That's just uh, how it goes now. And I really hope that you uh, you could support us. OK. One thing I forgot to uh, say you is that there are uh, if you play the Kowalki demo in the beginning of the demo, you will see a cross, a green cross, that was in that time because we used uh, an application that could run movies because at that time it was very difficult to get high quality in Unity, uh, cinema quality in uh, the movies. So um, that's just old and that's unfortunate, but we cannot change that anymore. I mean, it's so long ago, uh, it would not be worth to uh, work on that at all. Um, but in the end it's about the game, so yeah, just skip the movie with the escape button if you uh, don't like to see other things, because it's also, yeah, the animations are also not completely there. It was all, uh, yeah, it was a lot tougher than that time to make things work than nowadays, so that was also one of the reasons. Um, yeah, so that is that. And uh, maybe some other note about uh, Little Big Adventure remake. Also there, there are some things, you know, like uh, sometimes when something falls, the game can crash. Um, and there are also other things that were not finished at all. Some problems, uh, oh yeah, for example, the menu is also not working, you know, the menu. Um, so that's unfortunate, but that's just how it is. Uh, but I thought maybe good to tell that in this video so that you're not shocked or think it's your computer. Now it's us, it's just, uh, that we didn't have the finished product uh, at that time and uh, that's unfortunate but 
Well, that's just how it is. We still hope you really enjoy both of the demos. See you.